In this video, let me consider one numerical on initial conditions. In RLC series circuit shown below, find i of 0 plus d i of 0 plus by dt d square i of 0 plus by dt square if switch is closed at t equal to 0. This is the given circuit. Here we can see that R, L, C are connected in series across the 50 volt voltage source and there is a switch. Switch will be closed at t equal to 0. So before t equal to 0, switch was in open state. So in open state, current in the circuit is 0. So at that time, I of 0 minus will be 0. Similarly, the voltage across capacitor when switch is open, it was Vc of 0 minus will be equal to 0. Now we will assume that at t equal to 0, switch will closed. So when switch is closed, the current in the circuit will become I of 0 plus. As we know, at t equal to 0 plus, inductor acts like open circuit, capacitor acts like short circuit. Let me draw the circuit. At t equal to 0 plus, the equivalent circuit is shown below. So that is switch is closed now. We have register R. So inductor acts like open circuit. This is open and capacitor acts like short circuit. This is short circuit. This is open circuit and we have 50 volt voltage source connected here. So now current in the circuit will be I of 0 plus. So here we can see that as circuit is open current in the circuit will be 0 that is I of 0 plus is equal to 0 amp. From this also directly we can write I of 0 minus is nothing but I of 0 plus which is equal to 0 and similarly here we can see that there was a capacitor capacitor acts like short circuit it means Vc of 0 plus is 0 is equal to 0 volts. Now we will assume that at t greater than 0 plus we have to assume all the elements of the circuit as it is and we have to apply the KVL. Let me that is at, at t equal to at t greater than 0 plus we have to assume that all the elements are present in the circuit and we have to apply KVL to this circuit. So apply KVL to this circuit I can write E is equal to that current I of T is flowing that is R I of T plus voltage across inductor is L di of T by dt di of T by dt plus voltage across capacitor is 1 over C integration of I of T into dt. So let me call this as equation 1. Now at t equal to 0 plus this equation can be written as we can written as E is equal to R I of 0 plus plus L D I of 0 plus by dt plus 1 over C integration of I of 0 plus by into dt. So here we can observe that this is nothing but Vc of 0 plus that is voltage across capacitor. So now let me substitute the values. So E value is 50 is equal to we have R i of 0 plus. So i of 0 plus is 0. So R into i of 0 plus will be 0. So this value will be 0 plus. Now we have to find d i of 0 plus by dt. So L value is given in the circuit that is 1 Henry. So we have 1 into d i of 0 plus by dt plus so this is nothing but vc of 0 plus so vc of 0 plus is 0 therefore here it will be 0. So therefore we can write d i of 0 plus by dt is equal to 50 amps per second. So we found i of 0 plus and d i of 0 plus. Now we have to find d square i of 0 plus by dt. So now to find d square i of d, d square i of 0 plus by dt square we have to differentiate this equation because here we have the term d i of t by dt. If we differentiate this expression we will get 
L d square i of t by dt square. Let me differentiate equation 1. So now differentiate equation 1. We get so differentiate uh, differentiation of E will be 0 which is constant 0 is equal to so we have r i of t differentiation of that will be r t i of t by dt plus l d square i of t by dt square plus so here differentiation and integration will get cancelled will get i of t by c plus i of t by c so now let me substitute <coughs> time value that is at t equal to 0 plus this equation can be written as 0 is equal to r di of 0 plus by dt plus l d square i of 0 plus by dt plus we have i of 0 plus by c. So now let me substitute the values. Let me continue here. That is 0 is equal to r. So here r value is given which is 20. We have 20 into di of 0 plus by dt which is nothing but 50 plus l value is given which is 1 Henry. So that is 1. So this term should be kept as it is because we are calculating this. That is d square i of 0 plus by dt square plus i of 0 plus. So i of 0 plus is 0. So 0 divided by c will be 0. So from this expression I can find d square i of 0 plus by dt square will be equal to minus 15 to 20 into 50 is 1000 that is minus 1000 ampere per second square. So therefore, I can write the consolidated result that is i of 0 plus is equal to 0, di of 0 plus by dt is equal to 50 ampere per second and we have d square i of 0 plus by dt square will be equal to minus 1000 ampere per second square. Thank you for watching.